Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Pisces. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We are just going to see what comes up. Elephant. A long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser at the end. So obviously this is, you're going through something that is going to leave you wiser at the end. It's a physical or mental journey that you are going through. What do we have for Pisces? That's too many. Oh, there we go. August. Maybe this journey, something happens in August. August is obviously very prominent. Okay. We have three that fell out. Actually, four. Wow. So, we have seahorse. Family matters. So, you're dealing with some family matters. Scissors, disappointment in some of some affair. Scissors, what are scissors used for? Scissors are used for cutting, so you may have to cut something. You may have to cut something out. It has to do with a family situation, I believe. March, you could be dealing with somebody that is born in March, or March is very prominent. Same with August, you could be dealing with somebody that is born in August. Or something is going to happen in August. So this is somebody that's either born in March or something that has happened in March. Or in the same with August. Oh, June is prominent as well. You could also be dealing with somebody that is born in June. Um, or something has happened in June in, in which you that has to do with your family or a journey that you are taking you could also be dealing with an aries a leo or a gemini could also be dealing with another pisces a cancer or a virgo there is something that you need to cut that you need to cut out of your life Very interesting. You're gaining some sort of wisdom right now. What do we have for Pisces? You got some stiff competition there, Pisces. You do. Looks like there we got we got you 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 got some stiff competition. Beware. Five, five, five. Expect the unexpected. Life is about to change. This is a major life change. Five, five, five. This is necessary change. It's meant to be. Okay. This is personal freedom. This is uh, unexpected conflict that leads to change and competition. Fives are about competition. They're about changes. Um, and expect the unexpected. I think you're going to be dealing with some serious competition. Get one of these. Expect the unexpected. Temperance. Temperance is exchanging something lesser for something better. It's a timing. It's a card of timing. The time is now. It's blending to create harmony. Accepting. Accepting that something is over. Death comes before this card. I feel like you're going to be having a conversation with somebody that obviously you don't have a very good look on your face you know this is a difficult conversation with somebody there's a need to accept and compromise so you may need to make some compromises this month we have the page of coins in reversed on the bottom that is a that's some sort of financial loss or something about finances 
Um, everything happens for a reason with the temperance card. It's a card of change, okay? Accepting that something is over because the death card comes first. Some of you could be dealing with a Sagittarius. You could also be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It's a card. A temperance is a card of reason. Everything happens for a reason and a need to compromise. And I see stubbornness here. Unwilling to compromise. Well, you're going to be up against some competition, just so you know. Button heads with somebody. What do we have for Pisces? Six of Cups reversed. Six of Cups reverse, nothing stays the same, everything changes. Uh, freedom from obligation, somebody's going to be freed from their obligations. Queen of Pentacles reversed, Queen of Pentacles reversed is a money hungry greedy bitch. Eight of Wands reversed. That is jealousy. Somebody is jealous of another person. They're jealous. Um, blocking. Ungrounded. We have somebody here that is ungrounded. They don't, they're not stable. They're not solid. They lie. Eight of Wands reversed. Now that is things going in the wrong direction. You're dealing with somebody that is going to challenge you. I don't know if it's a child or something like that with the Six of Cups. Could be somebody from your past. Um, Eight of Wands reversed. That is jealousy, guilty. Um, somebody is not very awakened, selfish. There's somebody here that is very selfish and, we, and anybody can take on these energies. We have somebody here that is all about the money, 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 selfish. Doesn't care about the children, selfish. Blocking. Somebody is blocking something. Queen of Swords reversed. So we have the Queen of Swords reversed, the Queen of Pentacles reversed, Knight of Pentacles reversed. Somebody is going to try to block you from something. Or, the, or you're trying to block them. Could go either way. Queen of Swords reversed is not somebody to mess with. So the Queen of Swords, she is uh, in reversed. She's she's angry. The Queen of Swords in reversed. Oh my God, I would definitely be saying, Oh my God, uh, Queen of Swords reversed uh, will do anything. Okay, she she doesn't. There's some sort of dishonesty here. We have somebody here that is being dishonest, that isn't telling the truth. And I feel like we have a queen of swords that is, is going to uh, do something. She's going to do something on the fly. And it is somebody from the past or something about a soulmate here. The queen of swords in reverse is pissed. Five of Swords reversed. Get prepared for a battle, a competition, a struggle. There's going to be some sort of fight here. Or something is going to be exposed. 
some something is gonna it's the five of swords is, is like crime being exposed we have like a theft the knight of pentacles reverse it's like stealing money or somebody that i don't know if this has to do with an ex or whatnot there's some sort of money issues here we have somebody here that doesn't want to pay up or they or somebody is stealing somebody's money or something it doesn't belong to them or something like that it's all about the money this is extremely extremely selfish doesn't care who they hurt we have something with the five of swords this is like i don't care who i hurt as long as i get the goods as long as i get the money extremely hostile situation with the five of swords reverse that is very very hostile this, we have somebody here that is lazy, that doesn't want to work, that wants it handed to them, just wants the money handed to them. We have, we have somebody that you are dealing with that is very suspicious. They are suspicious of the motives. There's definitely jealousy issues. Could be jealous of, somebody here is jealous of, of the children. Death reversed. Six of swords reversed and strength reversed. All reversals except for the ten of wands. There's an absence of success here with all these reversals. And no, the deck isn't reversed and it is what it is. Holding on is getting old. We have somebody here This that is very, very troubled that is very controlling uh strength card reversed extremely controlling very egotistical enjoys the control that they have um that lacks respect for others that is trying to block somebody they're trying to stop somebody they're trying to stop somebody from moving on they're trying to stop somebody from getting getting what they deserve this is malicious behavior it's maliciousness it is there's maliciousness here ten of wands that is that is burdened carrying a heavy burden carrying a lot of baggage there's a need to let something go Knight of Pentacles reversed right in the middle. That is unstable. It's laziness. This is, I don't know if we have somebody here that is, is trying to get something with, that isn't theirs. It's like they don't want to work for it. They just want to hand it to them. There is somebody here. That maybe you're reluctant to move on. Somebody is reluctant to move on with the Six of Swords reversed. Very, very troubled. It's time to take a new approach. It's time to let something go. You know, it's not about the money. It's like holding on just for the money. Fuck the money. Ain't no love in these cards. May have something to do with a job. We have an individual here that is insecure, maybe financially insecure, doesn't know their value, wants something, wants it, and it doesn't belong to them. I do believe you're going to be up against some competition. You are. I think we have somebody here that is going to say something or they're going to do something that puts you on the spot. They may call you out. You get the Queen of Swords reversed. She's going to say whatever she's going to say to whoever needs to hear it. The whole world, maybe. The death card reversed. There's some sort of ending here. That is, we have somebody here that is refusing to let go.
Death reverse next to the Six of Swords reverse. That's refusing to change. Very stubborn, extremely stubborn. It's mine. I'm holding on to it because of the financial value. So somebody is holding on to something just for the financial reasons. That's it because there ain't, it, it, there's no love in these cards. None. There's an absence of love. It's all about the money. stiff competition there's going to be a change I feel like things started some time ago somebody is going to be freed from their obligations somebody is clinging to the past they're clinging to a partner from their past or, their, or a soulmate maybe it's a past life soulmate there's a, there is a past life situation here or a past connection that somebody is thinking about They're in denial. It could be the person you're with or it could be you. This, this is a lack of practicality, not being practical. I do believe that uh, there's strong control issues here. There's lack of respect. We have somebody here that enjoys the control. It's almost, I think we have like a narcissist here. Power hungry. Strength card reverse next to the Five of Swords reverse. We have a power hungry, greedy, selfish individual that is about to face some competition. This person is not genuine, they're not real, and they're about to get called out. refusing to take a new approach, hurting other people because of their selfishness. I think this has to do with a family situation and it has to do with children as well. I think there's some kind of family, I don't know if it's a family feud or what. I think that you are definitely going to be butting heads with somebody. There's money issues here. Holding on to something that isn't real, that isn't stable. There's no love in these cards. And I think it's because we have somebody here that is really reminiscing about their past with the Six of Cups reversed. It's not over yet. Something isn't over yet with the death card reversed. I feel like it's a past life connection. Somebody, I don't know if you're dealing with somebody that is going to be connecting with somebody from their past or is somebody from the past here. The Six of Cups is a past. First card out. Could be a past life soulmate. But there's a lack of practicality. There's a lack of reason. That's why that temperance card is a lack of reason. A lack of acceptance. A need to accept. Whatever is meant to be is meant to be. If it's, if it's you know, whatever. And there's, there's like, I can't let go. I can't let go because of the money. Because of the financial aspect. This is holding on for money. It really is. It's like, there's a need to walk away but can't because of the financial because of the financial reasons it's like you want to go you want to go you don't want to be with this person whoever this person is but there's some sort of financial uh tie i think you're going to be dealing with a competition this month I feel like there's going to be some exposure. You're dealing with somebody that is going to speak the cold, hard truth.
stop. It's because the Eight of Wands reversed and the Knight of Pentacles reversed is stop. They're both stop, stop, stop. Stop. I don't know, somebody's lying with the with the Queen of Swords reversed. That's a, we, <laughs> stop lying. Somebody needs to stop lying. They need to tell the truth. They need to be honest. We have a green-eyed monster here who only cares about money. And they aren't going anywhere without the money. It's like, no, I just want the money and that's all there is to it. I don't care who I hurt. I don't care about the falseness. As long as I'm in control, as long as I win at all costs, Eight of Wands reverse. There's jealousy. You're going to be dealing with with some competition this month. Somebody's going to be speaking something, and and it, and it may stop you right in your tracks. There's some sort of stop. Th things coming to a stop, coming to a halt, blocking, blocking something. extremely competitive hostile situation where somebody is in their ego they don't care who they hurt and they're going to be put to a stop it's like this is going to stop Whew. I think you're up you're going to be dealing with some there's some sort of fight here I do believe there's going to be a fight know you might be dealing with an Aries they just fell out the Emperor reversed and the Queen King of Wands could be you know Aries could also be a Taurus could be uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius somebody is angry or pissed or things are out of control action is going to be taken in some way going to get really, really, really pissed. We have a huge ego here. Huge. Trying to stop. We have, we have, somebody is trying to stop somebody. They're trying to stop somebody from moving or stop somebody from stealing or whatever. Somebody is going to see something. They're going to see something and they are going to get really, 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 really pissed. Get prepared for some conflict that changes everything. Good luck.